Hi everyone, I want to update you about my experience updating to the latest firmware of the version 3.1. It was released a couple of days ago, however, I didn't get the update until yesterday. So I believe the updates are distributed in batches, and even if it's available for my device, it failed multiple times, so I retried, retried multiple times until it's finished. And I heard there are multiple bugs in the updates, and this morning I found some patches, some new updates to the firmware. So let's have a look at the update history here. But it's all in Chinese. I don't know if I change the server to the US, it will be displaying in English. Let's try that. Mm -hmm. Update history. Well, it only has the main updates 3.1, but it doesn't have the newest patches. I believe it will catch up in the coming days, but now let's switch to the Chinese server and I'll try to uh, translate them for you. So now we have the update logs of the newest patches, so let's have a look at all of them. So first look at the March 15 updates. So firstly, they fix the issue of when you, in the notes app, when you put the menu bar on the right side, the floating window of the recording function has a certain issue. Secondly, they fix the dragging and turn pages of the customized templates. Thirdly, when you're in a document, when you're using the fountain pen and switch to eraser, the pen will turn to brush, so they fix this bug. So next, they fix the horizontal split screen related issues. Then they fix the calendar nodes and uh, the old nodes will not be displayed, the issue of this. And lastly, they fix some handwriting keyboard related issues. So in this March 18th updates, it fixed the when you insert text in the notes app, the canvas will automatically shrink. So the second issue they fix is when you sync notes from different sizes and the pages will not be properly displayed. So they also added the option of original size of the templates. So to solve the issue that when you change the size of the templates, the strokes notes will mismatch with the templates. So interestingly, these two updates are identical. They have the same version number. And I noticed that one of them is a full package and another one is the added package, add-on package. So I assume if your device has already been updated to the March 15 version, so the add-on package might help, uh, such as my device. But anyways, their two versions are showing here. It's all right. So the major updates, the features of the firmware 3.1 are already in the English update logs, so you don't need my translations. So probably by the time this video is uploaded, uh, the English version of the update logs of the latest patch already available. So by the way, don't worry if your device hasn't received the updates or the new patches. Just wait a couple of days and you'll have a more stable, you will have more bugs fixed and a better overall user experience. I hope this video helps and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.